This next move is called a power single, and it's really underrated. Uh, power single, it looks, there's a lot of ways to do it. It can look like a double leg, and based on his counter, or maybe I want to hit this move off the bit, right, right from the start, instead of a sweep, I attack more like a double leg footwork, but I'm attacking one leg. So for instance, if I'm facing this way, so the camera can see, let's back up. If I hit a double, and he starts to counter, instead of getting stretched out and squashed down, okay, come back up right here, instead of going here and extending myself, I'll switch to my lock right here, and come up, and go to whatever finish you want, right? And, there, and we'll go over this another time, whether if the leg's in between, or you got it this side or this side, there's a lot of finishes, we'll get to that in uh, another part of this video series. But a power single can be off of a double, Right? Or maybe he has a collar tie and I circle him. Or maybe I'll just, you know, just set it up and attack one leg and, and hit it as I go. So uh, let's have Jace hit a couple of those on me. Just hit one from this way and one from the other way. Just hit double and I'll take it away and go power single. And finish. Good. Um, let's go on the this way. Maybe do that other one we've been drilling. Right here? Yeah. Okay. Okay, Preston, let's have you hit a few. Just go double and don't take it away and go to power single. Step up and finish. Any finish. And that's it for the power single. And you'll notice a lot of times the power single is your first move didn't quite work and you just keep going instead of let, letting go, like, oh, that didn't work, just keep attacking. So it's an excellent second move. And if you can figure out a way to have it be a first move with a clear, clean setup, then go for it. But that's power single.